Here are some powerful verses that we should really think about. When the Quran talks about people, it gives us huge examples. It gives us the example of the Pharaoh who is this exemplar of evil and the example of prophets who are the exemplar of good. None of us are as evil or should be as evil as the Pharaoh or the devil and none of us are as good as the prophets. However, there are different elements of them that are mentioned in the Quran that we should really look out for. For example, in Surah Al-Baqarah, Allah Almighty talks about this one quality of the hypocrites. وَإِذَا قِيلَ لَهُمْ لَا تُفْسِدُوا فِي الْأَرْضِ قَالُوا إِنَّمَا نَحْنُ مُسْلِحُونَ That when it's told to them, don't cause corruption and havoc in the land, they say, what are you talking about? We are not the ones causing corruption. We are the ones causing good in the earth. I think if we take a step back and we really look inside ourselves, a lot of the major problems in the world are not done by those that think that they're doing something wrong. They're actually done by those that think that they're doing something good. If we really look at ourselves and the efforts that we are pursuing, we should objectively judge ourselves and see, are we doing good in the world or am I doing bad in the world? An example of this could be some of the different steps people have taken for Palestine. We should keep in mind that if we are taking steps to help Palestine, that involves sin, that involves antagonizing our Creator. At the end of the day, they're not going to be helpful, they're going to be harmful. So that's just one example, but throughout my life and your life, we can find many more examples from this verse. I hope it helps. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.